Adventures of Ozzie and Harriet, starring the entire Nelson family, Ozzie, Harriet, David, and Ricky. Here is Ozzie, who plays the part of Ozzie Nelson. And, of course, his lovely wife, Harriet, as Harriet Nelson. The older of the Nelson boys, David, appears as David Nelson. And his younger brother, Ricky, played by Ricky Nelson. Who's here? So this is where you've been hiding. I'm not hiding. I'm just eating my lunch. What do you got in the basket? A couple of salami sandwiches and an apple. Hey, how come you never eat lunch with us anymore? You know, I bet he's got a couple steak sandwiches in there. Hey, come back here. <laughs> sandwiches. Oh, it is salami. Well, this is awful. Here. No, oh, you can eat it on your way, wherever you're going. You know, somehow I get the feeling he's trying to get rid of us. You know, I think you're right. Well, you are right. Come on, you guys. Beat it, will you? Boy, what a grouch you turned out to be. I'm not a grouch. I just happen to enjoy eating my lunch here where it's nice and quiet, where I can relax and be alone with my thoughts. Now, that doesn't make any sense. Well, no, to you guys it doesn't. But I happen to be a little more sensitive to these things. I enjoy the beauties of nature. Hi, Wally. Oh, hi. It's a lovely day, isn't it? Yes, it is. Now it's beginning to make sense. The beauties of nature. Boy, you're not kidding. Who is she? Well, she happens to be a very lovely, talented girl who has all the friends she needs and who isn't interested in meeting anybody else. Oh, now, that's a likely story. Look, it just introduces and we'll leave quietly. Well, in the first place, she's not your type. Well, she's a girl, isn't she? <laughs> Come on, Wally, who is she? I won't tell you. Well, you might as well. We're not going to leave till you do. Well, I have a feeling I'm making a terrible mistake. But her name is Louise, and she's an art student, and she's been working on a landscape, and I've been working on getting to know her. So goodbye, adios, au revoir, de zane, au revoir, sayonara, aloha, and bon voyage. Louise, huh? <laughs> Come on, you guys, you said you'd go. Well, we are going. We are? Yeah, hey, we're going over to watch your paint. Oh, no, you don't. You can come with us. Hey, wait a second, Fred. Maybe this isn't quite fair. In what way? Well, Wally's already met the girl. Why should he come with us? I think he ought to stay here. Oh, yeah? Just try and make me. That's a spirit. Come on, you can introduce us. Let's go, Fred. <laughs> I had a feeling I was making a terrible mistake. <laughs> uh, is it okay if we watch for a minute? Sure. Are these friends of yours? Uh, well, yes and no. Uh, my name's Rick Nelson, and that's Fred Stacy. Hi. Hi. My name is Diane. Uh, Diane? Yeah, I had my fingers crossed. Uh, I, I like your painting. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Gee, that's real nice the way you have the sun shining through the trees there. Well, thanks. I was trying to get sort of an unusual effect. Oh, it's beautiful. Very realistic. Uh, that's Naples yellow you use there, isn't it? Yes, it is. Now, how did you know that? Well, I'm very interested. It's on the tube. Uh, isn't this about finished? Yes, I think it is. Uh, she told me she was going to do a portrait next. Oh, gee, that sounds interesting. Well, it will be if I can find an interesting subject. Oh, that shouldn't be too difficult. <laughs> I don't imagine you'll have to look very far. <laughs> you like to paint portraits? Well, I haven't done too much of it, but it's a lot of fun. Of course, it's a little tough on the subject. He has to sit for such a long time. Well, I don't see why anybody would mind that. I sure wouldn't. What about you, Rick? Oh, gee, I don't know. It might be a little embarrassing to sit there and have somebody stare at you. Oh, you'd get used to it. As a matter of fact, you have a very interesting face. Why don't you let me paint a portrait of you? Oh, well, thanks, but I don't know. I... Well, don't force him if he doesn't want to. But he didn't say he didn't want to. Well, obviously he doesn't. Actually, the more I think about it, it might be fun. Oh, I'm sure you'd enjoy it. Can you meet me here tomorrow at the same time? Well, yeah, I guess so. Oh, good. I'll see you tomorrow, then. Here, let me help you with this stuff. Thank you. Fine friend he turned out to be. I think he's trying to back out. Are you kidding? Well, what are you so upset about? I thought you were interested in some girl named Louise. Well, at least there's one consolation. I won't have to sit out here all alone tomorrow eating salami sandwiches. Come on, Fred. Well, that sounds wonderful, Rick. Yeah, I suppose so. What about poor Wally, though? He sat out there day after day trying to make an impression on this girl, and then you come along and move in on him. Are you kidding? He'd do the same thing to me if he got the chance. Besides, you know Wally. He falls in love with a different girl every week. Well, now that you've rationalized that, what's this girl look like? Well, he doesn't have to be interested in the girl just because she's going to paint his picture. Well, that may be true, but I'd still like to know what she looks like. But that's got nothing to do with it. What does she look like? 
Well, she's just a plain, average, beautiful girl. I thought so. Oh, where do you want me to sit? Oh, right here will be fine. How's this? Well, that's fine, but just relax a little. Uh, what'll I do with my hands? Oh, anything that's comfortable. You can fold them in your lap if you like. Oh, that's a good idea. Uh, do you want me to smile? Well, uh, it'll have to be a pretty long smile. Oh, yeah. Well, well maybe I won't smile. Uh, could you turn your head just a little to the right? How's that? There, that's fine. Hold it. You are allowed to breathe if you want to. Thanks. Just about finished. Are you tired? No, not at all. In fact, this is a lot easier than I thought it'd be. And it's kind of fun, too. Well, that's good. I've had a lot of fun. Well, I guess that does it. Oh, good. Can I take a look at it? Well, okay, but I think I'd better warn you. I've added something since the last time you saw it. How do you like it? Oh, gee, it's great. It's very flattering. Uh, where'd the pipe come from? Well, that's what I added. Don't you like it? Well, I, I don't know. I've never smoked a pipe. I just thought it'd be kind of a nice touch. Oh, yeah. I've always liked pipes. I think they give a man a distinguished look. Well? Of course, I can paint it out if you want me to. Oh, no, you might as well leave it in as long as you've got it there. It'll only take a minute. Oh, no, let's leave it. But as long as you've got the brush, how about... How about what? Oh, uh, a mustache might be a little too much. <laughs> Thanks for the note, Dave. Oh, that's okay. If you get a good grade, let me know. I may want to study from them myself. Oh, hi, Rick. Hi. Oh, is that the famous painting? Yeah. Let's see it. Hey, that's darn good. How come the pipe? Well, she thought it would add a distinguished look, I think she said. She sure did a great job. Oh, well, gee, thanks, Wally. I'm glad you like it. Uh, I was afraid you might be a little upset about the whole thing. Oh, why should I be? You know me, happy-go-lucky. In fact, I think this is terrific. Well, I wouldn't go so far as to say that. Are you kidding? Look at the way she separated the hairline from the eyebrows and got rid of those beady eyes. Why, it almost makes him look like a nice guy. Well, now, that's more like it. You had me worried there for a minute. I thought you were going soft on us. <laughs> Thanks a lot for the cake. Anytime, Wally. Yeah, I'll see you guys. Okay. Uh, hi. hi. Nelson, come on in. Make yourself at home. Hi, hi, hi. I think you'll like it here. The people are nice, the food is good, and they're having an art exhibit. <laughs> hi, good night. Is that the painting, Rick? Yeah, Diane just finished it. Oh, good. Let's take a look at it. Oh, I didn't know you had the painting here, Rick. Yeah, she just finished it. Hey, that, that's real good. Oh, it sure is, and it certainly looks like you. Yeah, she's a good painter. Uh, what's this with the pipe? I didn't know you smoked a pipe. Oh, uh, no, I don't. That was her idea. Uh, it, it gives you kind of a distinguished look. Yeah, that's what she said. I think it's just beautiful. What do you think, Dave? Oh, I think it's a very nice-looking pipe. <laughs> 
Don't you think she'd let us keep it? Oh, yeah, she gave it to me. Oh, hey, that's darn nice. I wonder where we can hang it. Oh, gee, do we have to do that? Why don't you just put it up in the attic? Oh, we have to hang it someplace. Uh, how about out in the garage? Or, or down in the cellar behind the furnace? All right, you guys. Ozzy? Ozzy? Yeah? I found a perfect spot for the painting. Oh, yeah. Now, 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 now wait a second. Uh, what was hanging here before? Oh, something was hanging there. You know, I've been thinking, somehow it doesn't seem right to have this nice painting of Rick and not have one of Dave. Well, yeah, uh, the same thing occurred to me. Do you suppose it'll hurt his feelings? Well, it might. He did act a little funny when Rick brought the painting in. Oh, I think he was just kidding. But it would be nice to have a portrait of Dave, too. Well, then why don't we have one painted? Do you suppose Diane would do it? Well, we, we can ask her. Hey, uh, maybe we could have her uh, painted as a surprise. Well, that's fine, but if he doesn't pose for it, how's it going to get painted? Well, she could probably paint it from a photograph. We could ask her. What was hanging there before? Oh, why don't I go in and call Diane? I think Rick wrote her number down. No, 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 wait a minute. It was my fish. What's this? My mounted fish. It was hanging right there. It was? Now, you know darn well it was. What did you do with it? Well, now, don't get excited. I found a very nice place for it. When you put the car in the garage tonight, you'll see it. 